With the click of a button, I can send my work to the entire world. It can feel empowering. I tap a screen and suddenly my ideas are reaching a larger audience. But what if that's not always ideal? True, audience matters, but so does solitude. There's power in disconnecting from the world and creating art for an audience of one. See, when I'm publishing to an audience, I'm thinking about how my work will be perceived. I want people to love what I made. So I'm sharpening my ideas, I'm reshaping my words, and at times I grow kind of risk averse. I start caring too much about what other people think, and it makes me less creative. But when I'm alone, I can make mistakes, big mistakes. Nobody knows, nobody cares. And this is why I journal. My journal is a forest filled with scribbles and sketches and wild ideas sprouting everywhere. I can go anywhere. I can dance and sing and yell. I can wander and wonder. I can take a creative plunge into the unknown because everything is an experiment. And that's the power of journaling. It's a secluded space of creativity.